Yo, what's up guys? Andy from TapLab back with another tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to send and receive Bitcoin on Cash App to and from other users using their cash tag. Okay, so this is a brand new feature that Cash App just launched that was posted in my top five features that could come to Cash App video. And this feature is a big deal because now we can send Bitcoin to any other user just with a cash tag. And we won't need uh, long Bitcoin addresses or anything like that. So it's much more user friendly. But let's get into this. We'll talk about receiving first. If you want to receive Bitcoin, it's very simple. Just tap in the top right corner on your user icon. It's going to say your cash tag right here. Mine is money sign Andy Path. So you would just send someone that and then they can send you Bitcoin. Then you don't have to do anything on your part, just wait to receive the Bitcoin. Now let's talk about how you can send Bitcoin using a Cash App. First of all, you need Bitcoin in your Bitcoin balance. So you can see my current balance is $4,852 worth of Bitcoin. Also, if we scroll down here, we can see my Bitcoin owned 0.08563855. So that's the amount of Bitcoin that I own and I can send that much Bitcoin to people. If you don't have Bitcoin yet, I'll go ahead and go through that process. First of all, you need a cash balance. So I have $109 here in my cash balance. And this is on the banking screen in the bottom left corner of the app. So if you don't have a cash balance, you can go to linked accounts on the bottom, connect your bank account, connect a debit card, and you can instantly transfer from that to your cash app balance. And then with your cash app balance, you can spend that using their cash card get discounts, adding those boosts there. You can go to the peer-to-peer -peer payment screen, send that back and forth, or you can invest your money in Bitcoin or stocks. And now you're able to send that Bitcoin to different users. I would also imagine that they're adding a feature that'll allow you to send stocks to different users as well. So that could be something to look out for this year as well. But let's go ahead and pretend I didn't have any Bitcoin. I'm gonna send $5 of Bitcoin today to people that commented their cash tag on this tweet that I did right here. So it looks like there's two comments so far nobody commented their cash tag but uh this person i saw included their cash tag in a different tweet so i'll just go ahead and send them some so first of all you want to have bitcoin in your balance so i'm going to go ahead and buy that five dollars that i'm going to send out to people let's tap next scan my fingerprint it's going to show us our order details tap confirm so i just bought the five dollars of bitcoin and that's gonna come from my cash balance there so i just spent five of this balance buying five dollars more of bitcoin tap this send arrow next to the sell button that's how you're going to send this to people and then we just want to tap send bitcoin we can type in the amount that we're going to send so i'm going to send one dollar you can also uh, hit this toggle and that'll show you the amount in bitcoin but this toggle doesn't really do anything it's just showing the amount so now let's go ahead and tap send um let's go back to this tweet and get this lady's name r b c h r s t 19. so we want to do money sign and we want to go ahead and type their name so i'm pretty sure that's the person i tapped on them and put the check mark next to their name now we can tap next it's going to give us our order details here it looks like there's no fee for sending Bitcoin within Cash App to a different user. So that's pretty dope. And then I just tap pay. Confirm your cash pin. I'm going to block out the screen for a second so you guys can't see this. Just got the notification there at the top of the screen that it sent. You just sent Bitcoin to this person. Tap done. So there we go. That's how you send Bitcoin. Now this says pending, so they may have to go in and click accept on their end. It really just depends how they have their cash app set up, but that has been sent from my end. They're just gonna have to click accept. That's how you do it. There's how to send Bitcoin on cash app. Go ahead, try to be one of the other four people that reply to my tweet first and I'll send you some Bitcoin as well. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope you found it helpful. Be sure to drop a comment down below if you have any questions. I'll try and answer those. Like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Okay. Don't lay your problems on the path.